Hello. Hello. Okay, so. No, we can't take the camera. Uh, you can't show that. Yeah. Alright, hold on, hold on. It's a widescreen, so now you've lost all the picture on the right hand side. So scroll back the way you did. Okay, like that. And then pull the then. <laughs> Hello. Here I am in Egypt, Dahab. And we are solving the movie, and we are about um, almost. One hour late, no, but it's all part of the show, and everything will be just perfect. Peace and love, harmony, blessed love. Man, we're sorry, dude. Uh, huh? Hello. Hello, world. Thank you. <laughs> sorry, we're late, dude. Yeah. Hi, beautiful. We had the vips. <laughs> Hi, beautiful. How do you like my hat? Great! Just a little longer, he's an angel. Yes. We have angels also, demons, angels. <laughs> For me, this was a very important film and is. It took me three and a half years to go through it from beginning to the end. And three and a half years it was on my mind, on, on my life, every day. And it changed me, changed me a lot, taught me so much about things and and so much energy was put into this film. We started this film in this hippie commune and we started it with love and wanted to change the world. And today I can say we changed the world and the change is happening all the time through us and we can really make a change, every one of us. We can change ourselves, the way we think, the way we feel after that, because our thinking is just like a big pile that sums up. We have to clean it all the time to purify ourselves from the bad thoughts. We don't, if we give them space, they just grow. Just cutting and the love will come and understanding, because there is space. Uh, I'd like to once again, thank you, and thank the Rush, thank Momo, uh, thank you, uh, thank the universe, and thank this cool experience. Oh, thank you, boom, enjoy the movie. Full power! <laughs> It's in the movie. It's in the movie. Oh, does it? Yeah. Yeah. Very interesting story. Um, yeah, there's a lesson in it as well about drugs. And, um, uh, yeah, it's very interesting. Very interesting. 
never seen a movie set in Finland or directed by a Finn, so it was the first. Yep, you like the, the music? Mm -hmm. Especially the song about bad sex. Yeah. I can relate to that. <laughs> first in Finland. <laughs> Yeah, and uh, I think it was a very good movie, interesting and uh, conscious movie, yeah. Music? Great music. Cool, wicked, fab, great. Smashing. In Scandinavia that was uh, well put together but also um, brought up social issues that were... Uh, demanded in Europe and also pivotal to the contribution of the youth to society. It's very different. And you have any feeling about it? Yeah, it was very different. Um, I like the images, I like the music. I didn't really get the storyline, to be honest. Um, I wasn't sure there really was a storyline, but um, yeah, it was, um, it was worth coming out for. Alright, cool, thank you. Okay, well... What I thought about the film. Yeah. Well, I really liked it. I um, I liked it. I found it very encouraging. I found it very encouraging, actually. I uh, to me, it's um, it's a representation. It uh, it uh, it tells me that there, I'm not alone in the world. There are other people that don't agree with the system. There are other people that are really willing to fight and just stand out and do their own thing. And uh, it's not an easy thing to do alone. So. Uh, when you see a film like this, and it shows you that there are other people out there, and they're doing even more than you are to get out of the system, it gives you heart and it gives you hope, and it just lifts your spirit. Cool. You feel like going to a mushroom party now? Oh, hell yeah. yeah me too. Hell yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Purifying life. Purifying life is around the bed. Today I thank. We have done a good job. Thank you. Today I dance. <laughs>